love football. I'm a really good goalkeeper. Like, passing. It's exciting working together. Seeing this is amazing, fantastic. I love football. The project's been a fantastic success. We've reached more clubs, coaches and young people than we ever imagined. I've benefited so much from this. It's about communication, but also about deaf identity. People meet here and realise they're the same. They're from the deaf world. The FA are highly delighted with the, with the success of the project. A positive aspect of, of the scheme has really been the number of deaf coaches who are now are progressing through the coaching pathway. The NDCS gave me funding for interpreters and paid for the course as well, which I'm grateful for. Plus, it's given me, as a coach, the opportunity to meet and liaise with other coaches and learn new techniques and coaching styles from them. Yes, have helped us to provide a lot of coaching and deaf awareness courses for ourselves, so, such as the um, British Sign Language for Football. We're able to feel more confident to communicate and associate with deaf players within our sessions. I established the club and then falls linked with the NDCS. The team is now involved with the NDCS tournaments. I'm having a good laugh. There are people everywhere. I love the matches. It's a real challenge for me. I'm having a great time. We're just having a great time. It shows the clubs and the coaches' commitments to being deaf-friendly. How they work and welcome deaf players into their club. From your, your Sunday League grassroots club that plays on the local park, all the way up to your Manchester United, Arsenal. Even the logo on the bottom of the fly is just letting people know it's a deaf-friendly club. Um, and the players are, are more than welcome to come and their coaches are trained um, and we've got lots of kids because of that. My dream for the future. I'd love to have lots and lots of British internationals with our senior deaf team. My aim is to work for a hearing club. I'd like to be a highly qualified coach. I'm, I'm, I'm hoping to be a role model for the children. I'm hoping in five, ten years' time that as a result of all this groundwork we will have the first professional deaf player who, who's at access to this project.